Hey guys, it's Betty on Two Hand. Welcome back. We are here in the lovely Rutherwood on Skycade. And today we are joining Daphne here to try and hunt down a lovely dragon. It has been quite some time since my video, or since a video on my channel, coming up nearly two weeks. Been quite busy in real life. And also, it has been two months since my last Skyrim video. So sorry about that. Even though we've got a massive crowd of no people watching. So let's get right into today's video by following Daphne to wherever in the heck of this world she's going. Now I have to try and remember the, the controls already. Which is actually quite impressive. Which is quite impressive. And we have our little follower behind us. Sorry, I didn't hear what you said, Daphne. Hello, rabbit. So we need to follow ahead and see where we're going. I'm not exactly where we're sure we're going, but I can hear some lovely wolves around here. Should have picked somebody else for your dip. Oh, you can kill it. Come on, kill it. Yeah, oh, I suppose I help. Where have you gone? I could always just break this, thank you. So now, I'm pretty sure we're just going to follow her to wherever we've got to go. Which I'm not exactly sure where we are going. Okay, we'll get to Cowan's Grove. And not looking for trouble, and yet there's some person standing down here. Better to stick together. Who are you? Maik wishes you well. Who are you? Maik knows the people of Skyrim are more open minded about certain things than people in other places. Okay, a little bit weird why you're just standing there. So what quests have we got active? The Blade in the Dark and Return to Horn to Arangard. I don't know, I suppose we're just following Daphne. So let's see where you were going to take us. Now I thought to talk about stuff while we're following her. This Skyrim has been was released, what was it, in 2011 or 2013 or something like that there. And Skyrim, I've noticed, obviously since I started playing it, I've noticed it's got a sort of theme that all the stuff in here seems quite similar to that in the Lord of the Rings and the Hobbit films. So this big city here on top of the rock seems exactly like the people, or oh, it's got this what wind helm no not wind helm why have i gone blank dragon search the dragon search keep is similar to the one or the style and their flag is similar to the horse people in lord of the ring I, i've forgotten their name even though i've only just been just finished watching the trilogy series they are the people who ride horses and along the big flats they're pretty much based around that there all the cities are sort of themed around the lord of the rings Dragons, except we've only got one dragon, which is Smog. Or Smeagol. Or Smeagol's the thing. Who are you? Maik is very practical. Don't I just he talk to no you? For How are you in front of us? So, all the theme seems quite similar to that there of Lord of the Rings, like the people who have created Falstar. Falstar, I think it is. Who have created. Skyrim seem like they've taken a lot of inspiration from the Hobbit or Lord of the Rings books. As you can see, like all the tracks are cut around. Okay, so we're going up here now. Are you lost or something? And like in here, like you see a lot of dwarves. We don't see any dwarves, but the dwarves are apparently being killed off, I think. Or they're known as a Dwemer on here, so they dwell in the bottom. Then we have those old little creaky little things who shoot the arrows at you down in the old mine shafts and that there, from where the dwarfs used to dwell. And those people there are pretty much similar to those of the orcs. Yeah, I suppose they're called orcs. Orcs or the little tiny trolls and that that live down in the ruins where they walk through and get attacked by them quite often. I've no idea where Daphne's going, we're just running up and down. 
I suppose we just keep following her around. Already five minutes in, in today's video, I think. And we still haven't gone that far. You can see all the little lovely visual glitches that appear in this game. I wonder what the, I've always wondered what the HD version of Skyrim would look like. Or is it remastered version? If it would perform or look a lot nicer. But I honestly don't want to pay to do it. We can't afford any delays. Can't afford any delays. Well, there shouldn't be any delays because we've cleared this place up here. So there should not be any more bandits living up here, hopefully. Since we definitely do not fall off the bridge and get ourselves killed. Can't. This is a notorious bandit hideout, but it's also the shortest way to Kynes Group, so we may have to kill a few bandits. You shouldn't have to kill a few bandits. We've already come through here. We're not looking for trouble. We need to get to Kynes Group as fast as we can. Okay, go to Kynes Grove as fast as we can, get you run down here for some reason, and then you're back up here. Don't know what you're doing. Oh, look, there's some boots and a sword. Better to stick together. I don't want you to get yourself killed before we even get there. Really? You don't think I can handle myself, Daphne? Pretty sure I can handle myself. That's one thing. That's one thing about Skyrim. Like you can dump stuff everywhere, and no one will clean it up. It will just constantly be dumped around. If you guys have noticed that, you can just dump stuff everywhere. You can come back weeks later of playing after the game, and just all be sitting there. No one takes anything at Skyrim. We may both end up dead, but at least it gets me out of Riverwood. <laughs> we may both end up dead. How much more further we have to walk? Let's just take it. Really, you have to walk that far? Uh, that's the thing about Skyrim is like it's such a huge map. I can't remember if you can zoom. Out. Can you zoom in? You can zoom out. Like it's such a massive map going along the whole area. Like it takes so long to walk any places. That's why it's good when you discover everything to fast travel. And there are some patches in the Skyrim world that I actually have not been to. There's a few cities like this one here. Forks Wreath. I've pretty much... I don't know... What? Is it the Dark Brotherhood lives here or something? I'm not exactly sure because I pretty much never go to that side of the town. And I off every now and then I come up to the rift up here. Which... Where's my arrow? I can't see. There we go. Or Riften. Sometimes go up there. But not really often. So I'm not really sure what guilds to join. Okay, where are we going? Let's just keep on walking, keep on walking, and then... Let's just take it a while. Because I'm, I'm not sure really if I should be speeding up any of this stuff. Because then I can miss important little details of like picking little... little picking mountain flowers strolling around or miss any action of stuff up here like these people here okay I can't remember what that sound is if you guys could hear that that little creaking sound some meat. Okay, give me nothing then. Okay, let's keep walking. Let's keep walking through this lovely wilderness. And the lovely abandoned castles that are up there. Then throughout the Skyrim world you also find the little abandoned houses which we do find just outside of the Shire as well where that little farmer and kids used to be. Where they see that lovely troll or meet that lovely troll in the first Hobbit. Which is pretty good. And those trolls that are there. Not trolls, they're gi giants. I don't know, I get my facts incorrect. But they're down at the Wet Workshop in Wellington, which is pretty cool to see in real life as well. Pretty interesting to see all the work they go down there. And the Shire is an absolute amazing place to go see in real life. If you guys ever go and see it. Alright, hand over your valuables, or I will gut you like a fish. 
Really? You got me like a fish. Do I look like I have any money, man? Yes, actually. You look like you are lousy with gold. I am not going to ask again. Here, take it. Just leave me alone. I don't have time for don't this. You walk away from Never <laughs> oh, <laughs> that, oops. No, I want it. I don't realize I had speed run on. I was wanting to blow him over. Let's take that. Let's take that. Let's take. Oops, I don't, I don't want that there, but. Items all. What did I just pick up that I didn't want? I think I was up here because like everything adds up to stuff that I really don't need, like iron shield. You better keep moving. Yep. Which I might just go into my magic, and I might change that shout over to railing force. Just so I don't do that again. Anyway, what was I talking about? The shy in the shy in New Zealand is absolutely amazing. If you go check that out, it's like it's got such an amazing. So they do such a good job There's to keep everything nice and road. pristine Redwood. and exactly like the Here film in there. Nice Giant, Giants, yeah, they are, they are giants or trolls or something. They can't. Oh, they turn to stone during the sun anyway. I just can't remember what they are. Uh, and it's up in Mata Mata, I believe it is. Or matter why. Don't take me on the fence because I'm pretty bad at getting them all correct. So we just keep walking. And the only thing that this Skyrim is sort of lacking that we do have in the world of Middle Earth is the lovely. Is the lovely Mount Doom. Which we do have also in New Zealand, it's located in just out of Topor. About a 40 minute drive out of Topor. And that there is located, or oh, it's got a lovely um, Tongaro crossing, it's located along there. And you can see that there in person as well, the lovely Mount Doom. Good, I can use the practice, keep repeating the same word. Doesn't get boring at all. Okay, I'm just going to keep going along and going along this path here. And I wonder if we've got any bandits up here, because we see it looks like a little bandit area. I'm glad area. you were willing to trust me. I know it probably wasn't the best way to introduce myself, but old habits, you know. Jeez, just keep running, don't you, Daphne? This is a lovely town up here. What's this place we're looking at? Is it on the map? Oh, Windhelm. I don't think I've seen it from this side before. A lovely area where the storm cloaks live. Beautiful territory. At least I've seen it from this angle. I normally come along the road that comes along here. Yeah, and we come along that road just there. Okay, let's keep walking. At least we're going to discover this stable so we can fast travel here next time. Okay, let's get up and run. Run as fast as you can. You can't catch me because I am Not a gingerbread man. Kind's Grove is just down the road to the southeast. I can't remember Kind's Grove being covered in snow. Must have been. Anyway, I just want to quickly discover the stable so I can fast travel here if I need to. Here we go. Yes, I'm coming, I'm coming. Let's go. Remember, we're not looking for trouble. We need to get to Kind's Grove as fast as we can. And yet she keeps repeating the same text, which is absolutely a beautiful, my darling. Much to look at. The innkeeper ought to be able to tell us if there's any dragon nearby. Now coming up soon, I should hopefully be able to have a better control. Because right now, to play this Skyrim, I'm using a PlayStation controller, which I'm pretty sure I've stated before. And all the controls on here are set up for a Xbox controller. 
So I should hopefully have one of those coming in the mail Wait, eventually. No, you don't want to go up there. A dragon, it's attacking. A dragon is attacking. Where's this dragon? It flew over the town and landed on the old dragon burial mound. I don't know what it's doing up there, but I'm not waiting around to find out. Come on, hurry. It might be too late. Ooh, attacking. Now. Now, I can't remember what happens here. Is it a dragon attacking, or is it one raising the dragon from the dead? We shall soon see. Come on. We need to find out what's happening. Lorcan dies. Look at that big bastard. Keep your head down. Let's see what it does. Big dragon. Nice dragon. I thought one thing I should probably do is I should probably save this in case I die. And I have no clue what save we're actually working on right now. So let's go Skyrim. Let's just quickly save it there. Now where are you, dragon? Oh, that's nice and cold. Ice dragon. At least ice is a lot nicer than fire, which burns through the soul. Ow, that burns. Oops, wrong way, sorry. Ow, oh no, that's bad. That was bad. Oh, you guys should be used to this by now. I am terrible at playing this game. Okay, at least... At least we are still going. Oops, sorry, wrong way. Here we go, at least we killed this dragon. absorbing all that power even though I don't really deserve it because I keep dying whenever I try and kill them. Beautiful. Oh, da, da, yeah. it's true, isn't it? You really are Dragon Ball. I 
I owe you some answers, don't I? Yep. I owe you some answers, don't I? Yes, you do. Go ahead. Whatever you want to know. Nothing held back. Who are you, and what do you want with me? What do you know about the dragons coming back? Not a damn thing. I was just as surprised as you to find that big black dragon here. Who are you, and what do you want me? I'm one of the last members of the Blades. A very long time ago, the Blades were dragon slayers, and we served the Dragonborn, the greatest dragon slayer. For the last 200 years since the last Dragonborn Emperor, the Blades have been searching for a purpose. Now that dragons are coming back, our purpose is clear again. We need to stop them. I've seen that dragon before, the one that got away. The Blades, who are they? What's that next to me? I've seen that dragon before. Really? Where? It was the one that attacked Haugen when Ulfric escaped with the Imperials. Same dragon. Damn it, we're blundering around in the dark here. We need to figure out who's behind it all. What about the Thalmor? The Blades, who are they? Exactly. Nope. We used to be known across Tamriel as the protectors of the Septim Emperors. Those days are long gone. For the last 200 years, we've been searching for the next Dragonborn to guide and guard, as we are sworn to do. But we never found one, until now. What's our next move? The first thing we need to do is figure out who's behind the dragon. The Thalmor are our best lead. Yep, see If they Thalmor. aren't involved, they'll know who is. Rami, who are the Thalmor? The faction that rules the Aldmeri Dominion. The ones who almost destroyed the Empire during the Great War many years back. There's no worse enemy to humankind in Tamriel. The Empire barely survived the last war. The Thalmor don't intend to lose the next one. What makes you think the Thalmor are bringing dragons back? Nothing solid, yet. But my gut tells me it can't be anybody else. The Empire had captured Ulfric. The war was basically over. Then a dragon attacks, Ulfric escapes, and the war is back on. And now the dragons are attacking everywhere, indiscriminately. Skyrim is weakened. The Empire is weakened. Who else gains from that but the Thalmor? So we need to find out what the Thalmor know about the dragons. Any ideas? We could get into the Thalmor Embassy. It's the center of their operations in Skyrim. The problem is that place is locked up tighter than a miser's purse. Hmm, I'm not sure yet. Meet me back in Riverwood. If I'm not back when you get there, wait for me. I shouldn't be long. Keep an eye on the sky. This is only going to get worse. Sure. Deathly secret door key edit. Thank you. And now, let's go and meet Deathly Riverwood. But first, I want to return this horn back to these people up in dragons back in high hot car and yes i'm butchering all these names most tourists assume dragons were a legend until now okay let's go up here and return this lovely horn to them is there anything out here that i can steal let's take that there let's take that there let's take that there they don't need it we need food. They do not need to eat. Okay, let's go in here and let's have a look what we need to do. Hello? Oh, people, where are you, Greybeards? Here we go. Got an arrow over here. Let me interrupt your prayers. Retrieve the horn of Jorgen Winko. Yep. Well done. You have now passed all the trials. Thank you. Come with me. It is time for us to recognize you formally as Dragonborn. Thank you. Show me where to go. You are ready to learn the final word of unrelenting force. Da. Which way am I going? Ok, 
Okay, we go this way then. Let's go down here. So magic shouts, force balance, and ah, uh, which I should be picking up now. Four graveyards, yep, perfect. Yes, I want to definitely use it wisely. Oh, feel the old man power being absorbed into me. Beautiful. We would speak to you. Stand between us. Prepare yourself. You can withstand the unbridled voice of the Greybeard, but you are ready. Oh, beautiful. of the Greybeards and pass through unscathed. High Hrothgar is open to you. Thank you. Thank you for that there. And now, have I got a new mission to do? High Hrothgar is open to you, so we should be able to go through here. Let's open up the gate, and let's see if we can pass through. I'm not sure if I can or not. Let's, let's see. We can pass through this lovely wind up here. Ow. No. Let me move back. Let me move back. Okay. Whoa. Okay. Now let's try and use a shout. No. Oh, that takes a lot of damage. I thought about to get through. Obviously not. So let's go meet Daphne back in Riverwood. I thought about to get back through there. I'm not sure how you get through there now. Anyway, let's go back and continue with the Blades quest line. And one thing I've never managed to get on this um, Skyrim episode is the lovely. There's been another dragon attack. This yep, time. I know that I was there. Now, I do know the one thing that I have never had in this game is armoured. Not armoured. Dragoned armour, which I want to get eventually, hopefully. It's just taking me some time, and I'm not exactly sure how to craft it because I'm terrible at using the smithing tools and all that there. I don't think you oh, yeah. Come on, I have a plan. Yep, let's have your plan. Now, oh, where are you? Move! Move! Move, Lydia! Come down here, Lydia! Come on, good girl! Let me get past. Oh, come on, Lydia! Seriously, get out of the door, because I need to get up. I figured out how we're going to get you into the Thalmor. Embassy. Okay, yep, what's the way? That didn't take long. I've been doing this a long time, remember? While the Thalmor have been looking for me, I've been watching them. That's nice. So what's your plan? How do I infiltrate Thalmor? The Thalmor ambassador, Ellenwyn, regularly throws parties where... 
I can get you into one of the... I have a contact. His name is Malborn. Wood Elf. Plenty of reason to hate the fellow. I'll get word for him to... While you're doing that, I'll work on... Meet me at the Solitude Stables after you've arranged things with Malborn. Any questions? Okay. I'll see you at Solitude after I meet Malborn. Sounds good. Be careful. What? Something you're still confused about? Um, who's just going to sure I can trust them? How am I going to get into Buddy once I'm inside the city and what? Don't worry about Malborn. He's not a danger. He's a wood elf. Luckily, they don't know who he really is, or he wouldn't be serving drinks at the embassy. Okay, so if I go along here. Quest general stats. No, it must be on. Um, items, is it? I'm pretty sure I'm Wood Elf. What? Something you're still confused about? I'm not confused about anything. Just let me out. Come on, come on, come on, let me out. What? Something you're still confused about? Yes, just let me through. <laughs> Okay, and I want to take your coin purse, and I want to take your large sack of salt. Anything in here that I can take? Oops. I did not want to take all of that stuff there. What else? Can... Okay, so let's do a time of dumping, which always helps out, because you can get rid of all the junk that you just have randomly picked up. It's like, I see a ruined book. Why would you even need a ruined gut? Why would you need a skull? Why would you need a wooden plate at all? you always always need gold you can never have enough gold and you can never ever have enough food in this game gold and take gold okay now let's go visit the sky can I take this I don't want wooden plates but the amount of stuff you slowly pick up I'm not confused about anything if me so let me do my traveling Okay, so I have to go over to here. No, okay, so let's go to here. And I suppose let's walk all the way up to here. But then yet again, I could get a horse carriage there, which would be a lot, much quicker. So what is it? In solitude, okay, let's go down to... Morthal, whatever you call it. Have I discovered that? I'm not sure why I've discovered this here for. I'm not sure where the horse and carriage is, which I need. What's the yarl going to do now? How do I fast travel to that town? Because I really don't want to walk, I'm too lazy. Let's just go to the horse. At least you can fast travel like this here, yeah, it helps out a lot more. Otherwise, it can just drag out for so long. Okay, so we're going to Solitude. Need a ride? I'd like to hire your carriage. Where do you want to go? I want to go to Solitude. Climb and back and we'll be off. Thank you. Twenty gold. And it should instantly take my gold out now. First Thank you. Solitude? Beautiful old city. Capital of Skyrim, but I'm sure you already Capital of Solitude, the capital city. Now, I'm not sure which one this here reminds me of out of Sky, out of the Lord of the Rings. Hey, yeah, how's it going? If you've come to Solitude to join the Legion, speak to Ricker. If not, keep your nose clean. Hi. How's it going, guys? And now let's go in here and see what this lovely city has to show for us. I still love the city, but I never know how to get in and out of it. It's so confusing. Oh, what's going on here? They can't hurt Uncle Bog here. Tell them he didn't do it. Position. Far, you need to go home. Go home and stay there until your mother comes. Get on with it! You betrayed us! You should tell her Traitor. that uncle is scum that betrayed his high king. Best she know now. That's my brother up there. That's my brother up there. Oh, yeah. Sorry, I need to pay attention so I can remember this. After he murdered high king Tori. 
By opening that gate for Ulfric, you betrayed the people of Solitude. He doesn't deserve to speak! There was no murder. Ulfric challenged Tori. He beat the High King in fair combat. Such Stand back. Interrupting an execution is a serious crime. And all Nords! Stand back. Interrupting an execution is a serious crime. I remember this. On this day, I go to Sovngarde. <laughs> Let's take the Rogger Bear. Let's talk to him. They give this an emissary of Telos. Not a search, it said talk to him before. Some gate guard you were! We should have drawn it out some more. He deserved a slower death. I thought you were an angry guy, jeez. I expected more. Not right now. Okay, not right now. Okay, let's go in here then. The Winging Skeever. See that guy getting executed? Beautiful. Hi there. Good afternoon. Really? You're who she. Here's the deal. I can smuggle some equipment into the embassy. Don't plan on bringing anything else in with you. The Thalmor takes security very seriously. Give me what you can't live without, and I'll make sure to get it into the embassy. The rest is up to you. Okay. I already here's okay. what I need. I'll get this inside the embassy for you. I've got to go. I'll find you at the party. Don't worry. Potions, health, healing. What else can I give you? Food. Let's give you food, bread. Let's give you some carrots because I might need these. And I think that's all. Your job is to get into the party without being fingered as a spy. I'll take care of the rest. Okay. Now I'm assuming I'm gonna look pretty naked. Pretty naked. Your job is to get into the party without being fingered as a spy. I'll take care of the rest. I love how that little girl just said that. You're naked. Of course I am. I'm a drunk hobo. Okay, let's go. Now where do we have to jump to? Oh, I'll be definitely at the same. Okay, let's go do that. For being fingered as a scar. Traditional has it that the Nords came to Tamriel from the continent of Atamora, however you say that. Okay, let's get down here. Run, run. Quick. Run on my naked body. Oh. 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 This is so far to run. Oh. There we go. I wonder what you think of me being pretty naked. Is this about the stables? My husband Gaiman handles the business. Yep. Have you given Malborn the gear you want to smuggle? It? Yes, Malborn's all set. I have your invite, but the only way you're going to get past the guards is if, which means you need to look the part and not be armed to the teeth. Here, when you're ready, I'll keep the rest of your gear safe until you get back. You'll only have what Mal. I can't go to a party at the Thalmor Embassy dressed like this. What do you mean dress like this? I'm gonna go dress like this to see what happens. But first off, let's just save. Just in case. Oh. You can't go to a party at the Thalmor Okay, I suppose I have to be dressed then. Let's go to the PL and let's put on 
Blue robes, party, party. Well, I look pretty decent. I guess that will have to do. You should pass for a real guest, at least until you open your mouth. Ready to board the carriage to the embassy? I'm ready. Keep the rest of my things safe for me. Just make sure you get back out of there alive with the information we need. Good luck. Good luck. Thank you. And I'm hopping onto the carriage without wanting to ask for consent. Now let's go. Feet to black screen. How did we get to see the lovely high elf? Ah, a fellow latecomer to Ellen's little soiree. And arriving by carriage, no less. I salute you, sir. My lateness is due more to getting lost on the way up this god's forsaken mountain than what? desire to actually arrive late. I prefer to arrive early. Often the day before the party. I don't know what you're talking about, man. Welcome to the Thalmor Embassy. Oh, yes. Your invitation, please. Thank you, sir. Go right in. Thank you. Now let's go in and let's see what this high standard of living is like, my darling. Ooh, nice woman here. Hi. Welcome. I don't believe we've met. I am Ellenwyn, the Thalmor ambassador to Skyrim. And you are? My name is Colin McCotty. Pleased to meet you. Quite a party. It's my first time. You know where I can get a drink. Ah, yes. I remember your name from the guest list. Please, Madam, tell me more. What is it Have now, Lord? Right. It's no just that we've run out of the Alto wine. Do I have your permission to uncork the... Of course. I've told you before not to bother me with such trifles. Yes, Madam Ambassador. My apologies. We'll have to get better acquainted later. Please, enjoy yourself. Okay. The hospitality of the Thal... Quite often, yes. The only thing I enjoy more than luxury is sharing that luxury with those who can appreciate it. But I also okay. enjoy learning the latest gossip. I can see you spared no expense. Of not. One does not gather the most important men and women of Skyrim and then serve them cheap ale and stale. This is only a taste of the benefits what is your position that the Thalmor Embassy involved? One of my main duties is to foster a better understanding between the Aldmeri Dominion and the people of Skyrim. I also oversee the activities of the Thalmor Justicias throughout Skyrim. Although this has been most unfortunate. The Thalmor Justicias are so often misunderstood. Our primary goal is to preserve the peace between the Empire and the Aldmeri Dominion. The worship of the false god Talos contributed to the unfortunate friction that led to the Great War. Following the Great War, the White Gold Concordats, the Empire and the Dominion agreed. But I'm sure you didn't come here for a lecture on high politics. Okay, so she's clearly, uh, clearly against religion. What can I yes, what do you need? I'm like a drink. There you go, sir. The finest Colovian brandy. Is there anything else I can get for you? We seem to have run out of Colovian brandy. I'll check in the wine cellar for more when I get a moment. Of course. Let me see if we have another bottle of that. I'll be waiting by the door for everyone to be distracted. If we're going to be distracted, let's take this, let's take that, let's take that, let's take that. Oh, yum, yum. This is the only place where I literally can get lots of... Oh, dear. Oh, I don't want to take the bowl, I just want to take with the food. Because this stuff here is always good. Oops. When you take stuff... Here we go, pick up all the food off the ground, nice and beautiful. Oh, there's more here. Let's take that there, and I believe it's you. Oh yeah, you were outside, weren't you? Yeah, I brought you a drink. 
Wonderful. I can be here, you say? Is that all? Stand back and behold my handiwork. We are not supposed to talk to the guests. Oh, sorry, it's upper class. Attention, everyone. Could I have your attention, please? I have an announcement to make. Let's go. Let's go. Before anyone notices us. When our mistress, what is I speak figuratively. Nothing could be more unlikely than someone would actually put her in their bed. Oh, most of you are so far so good. Let's hope nobody saw us slip out. Okay. Need to pass through the kitchen. Your gear is hidden in the larder. Just stay close and let me do any talking. Got it? Follow me. Wouldn't want to offend our Thalmor overlords, would we? Who comes, Malvern? Bring me a drink, you know I don't like strange smells in my kitchen. A guest feeling ill. Leave the poor wretch be. A guest? In the kitchens? You know this is against the rules. Rules, is it, Savani? I didn't realize that eating moon sugar was permitted. Perhaps I should ask the ambassador. Get out of here. I saw nothing. Your gear is in that chest. I'll lock the door behind you. Don't screw this up. Option, yep. Retrieve my gear. Now let's put all this stuff on. This stuff on, yep. That there, that there. And let's... Quest time's going to be removed from the inventory, really. Weapons. And let's go up. And I have to... Yes, I know we need to get going. I just need to quickly get all my stuff back up and going. Here we go. That there is pretty good. Lock the door behind you, or the patrols might notice something's wrong. I need to lock the door behind you, or the patrols might notice something's wrong. Did good you luck. see those robes? You're on your own. There's someone there. Who are they with? More of the emissaries. Magic. All and let's go down and equip the flame. Oh, jeez. Last oh, we did a save. We did a save. That's the thing that always comes to my mind. Now let's go into my items. Let's go to the peel. Oh, I want to got all this equipped. Let's go to weapons. Oops. Why does it say steal for? I did not steal anything. So let's equip that there. It's not a, and it's not what I wanted. I always hate trying to get all this stuff back up and going again. If someone misses me at the party, we're both dead. Did Good you luck. see those robes? You're on your own this now. morning. Who are they with? Is someone more of the emissaries duty enforcement? <laughs> <laughs> So, as you guys can see here, I am pretty bad at trying to fight. Now let's go into Magician. Let's go into Flames. I'm going to die again. Okay. Okay. Let's have another attempt at doing that there. I need to lock the door behind you, or the patrols might notice something's wrong. Items. Now let's go across to weapons. Magic. All. Let's go. Like that there. Left. And then we go up into items. Put that there on the right. Items. Weapons. And favorite that there. To get back before I missed. Did Good you luck. see those robes? You're on your own. Now. Who are they with? More of the emissaries treaty enforcers? 
No, they're high mages, just in from Alinor. I guess myself is finally getting worried about all the dragon attacks. Ah, good. I've been wondering how we were supposed to defend this place from a dragon. Is someone there? Never should have come here. Ah! Let's go start. Let's save that there. Save it there. Level up. Let's increase our health and let's increase our stamina. Let's increase our health again and let's increase our stamina again. Health. Oh, what level am I? Okay, no, I don't want to do that. Really? Come on. Got to love this game. <laughs> I'm so fit to get this game, but I've seen my friends who play it. They used to just be able to come in here. They used to just be able to come in here and just literally destroy everyone. Health? Okay. Health? Okay. Stamina? Okay. Stamina? Okay. Stamina, okay. Really, I'm dead again. Okay. Move it up, really? One, two, three. One, two. Okay, so now that we've killed that guy there, now let's get some potions of health. Let's have some more of that there. Items. And let's go to food. There's got to be something that increases stamina. Really? Nothing increases stamina, okay. Come on. I got him searched. Now, one thing that I always do whenever I go for here is I need to take their stuff because they can actually sometimes have quite some nice bits hiding on them. I suppose it is take, take, take. Anything else in here? What's this down here? Found more robes. Found more gloves. Okay, let's get that there. Let's continue going through here. And let's, I'll do another save just before we get taken over. I want that there, that there, that there. Beautiful. Let's go through here and hopefully no one else is through here. And let's quickly open the Skyrim and let's just quickly sneak down along here. It may save as soon as we get through. Oops. I'm not sure how you're supposed to like unless you get past these guys because they're so. Sh okay, let's just stand here and get ourselves 
anything I can take that's good? Okay, let's go. Items, food, potions. Now, how often does people actually die trying to do this stupid quest? Because I always seem to just completely struggle with it. Come on, let me jump over. Let me jump. I need to get him before he comes back. Oh, really? That's why, can, why can't I jump in this game? I never understand that. I'm definitely going to die. Oh, no. I actually survived, really. Come on, stop zooming in. See everything? Okay. I don't think any more of them come along. I just want to quickly see if there's any other bits that I can see it off. Oh. I need to get rid of that mark that's irritating me. Remove it. Okay, perfect. Anything else in you? that I can use gold, wine perfect now it's a bit weird how I can't jump in this game oh yes I can it's it's a triangle okay. now it's going to here and let's get ready to be killed but I need that money. Surely got some potions. Potions of healing, potions of health, food, and this is what it always does when we just quickly spam it along. Ah, oh, where have you gone? You should be. There's someone else in here, isn't there? Let's get that there, let's get chamber key, let's get all this, let's get that, 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 that. oh beautiful. Now since you've taken since you've pretty much killed me, I need all the food I can get. Anything else? Oh, chest, anything else in here? And yes, I know it is getting close to the time of finishing off, but we need to continue getting all the pieces that we need, or otherwise I'm just gonna die. Don't even know what potion haggling is, but let's just take it. Anything high over here? Potion of health. Let's get that. Let's get that there. Okay, I was meant to get something out of here, isn't it? Wardrobe? So, okay, so it's around that way. Oops, let's go. Get myself motion sickness by trying to figure out how to get around. Is there anything in your body that I can need? Nope, nothing in there. Just a couple of sweet rolls and should be around hiding in here. Let's get that there. Let's get that there. And let's get that there. Perfect, and is it hiding down this way here, maybe? Nope, okay, is that the only other stairway that we need to try and get out of this building? Have you got anything on you? Yep, let's take that, let's take that, let's take that, let's take that. I just take everything on everyone, that's what I do. I'm bad at hoarding things in this game. Now let's go through here and let's save before I get myself killed. 
save and let's work our way down here. Never should have come here. <laughs> Okay, anything that I can use out of here? Nope. Anything in here? Take that there. Anything else? Oh, hello. I told you. I don't know anything else about it. I'm not here to torture you. What? Who? What? What do you want then? No time to explain. Let's get out of here. Yeah. Sure. Come on, this way. I've seen the guards use it to get rid of bodies. It must lead somewhere. Hold on, you may know something important. I damn well hope so. They're after some old guy named Esburn. Something to do with dra I've seen a guy in Riften who they seem to think not much to go on. That's it. Now, let's get out of here. No problem. Thanks for springing me. I owe you. Look me up in Riften if you make it out. Weapons. Huh? Oh shoot, sorry, I didn't mean to hit you, man. Okay, he died. Now let's go. Start, s load, down my message I want to try and save this guy. I don't want him to die. Never should have done open up to this here and see what's through this door. I don't think I've been through here before. Oh, not. Okay, what? At least the exact same room? Makes no sense. Okay. Let's go down and free this guy then. I told you. I don't know anything else about it. Okay, yep, I know that there. What? Who what Yeah. Come on. This way. I damn well they're after some I've seen it not much to go on. That's it. Now, let's get out of here. No problem. Thanks for springing me. I owe you. Look me up in Riften if you make it out. Listen up, spy. You're trapped in here, and we have your accomplice. Surrender and go. Oh, did she die straight away? Okay, where have you gone? Anything in here? Let's get that there, and yes, there is a chance I... I skip over some things that I need. I saw guards dragging bodies over here. Might be a way out. Whatever you 
want. But let's go now. Now let's go through here and let's see because I believe this is a part where I struggled actually the most. And then as soon as we make it out of the Thalmor Ambassador, that's where we'll end off today's episode of Skyrim episode six. No, what did you push me off for? Idiot. Oh, that's great. I wanted to paralyze him so I could kill him. little gem down there I want that as soon as I come back and if it's still there why Valmore will be hunting me for the rest of my life I hope it was worth it I want this out here first, because that's the way to get out. Okay, all we have to do is get past. I'm not sure what I picked up then, but I'll have to I'll pick it up soon. And hopefully this troll won't make it out since we've pushed him into an area where he's stuck. And hopefully. There we go. Perfect. Now the Falmor will be hunting me for the rest of my life. I hope it was worth it. I should have known this would end badly. I can't believe I let Delphine talk me into this. Let's get out of here for pity's sake. Okay, and when I see you guys next time, we will be back in the same place here. So let's how do I do this? Thanks everyone for watching this video, and I'll see you guys next time in Skyrim. Well, first off, I want to see what this new, was it? ABCDHKLMNOPQSTUV. An unusual gem. I can't remember what these are used for, but this, oh, that's pretty cool. You can zoom in there. So, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Let's cue this lovely outro, and well. Yeah, cue this lovely outro, and I'll see you guys next time in a Skyrim or in a lovely Minecraft video. See you guys next time, and thanks for watching.